name is Pixelated Twix. So welcome to my channel and welcome to another one and done. This one is on Lake. And this was a key that was given to me by the developer via Indie Bros. And I just want to say thank you for letting me take a look at your game. Uh, this is, from what I gather, this is a story driven uh, type game like uh, Life is Strange. Um, so that's really all I know about it. So I am definitely going in here blind, but this should be interesting. Um, so let's go. I went ahead and checked the settings, checked the music, uh, some of the, the sounds in the background, the ambiance, make sure that it wasn't too um, loud in my ear. And I wanted to make sure that you guys could hear me because I know that happened with Kataria Fables. I apologize for that. I did have to cut out some of the intro with that, but I digress. So we're going to go ahead and get into this game. Uh, let the loading screen do its thing, but I'm excited to see what this is about. Um, I honestly, I did enjoy Life is Strange. Um, it's not a game that I would have normally picked up if it wasn't for the suggestion of someone else. So um, I enjoyed the story behind it and all the twists and turns and surprise ending and what have you. So let's see what the lake is about. I'm hoping that the lake will give us the same type of entertainment value as Life is Strange. Um, it looks good so far. All right. So let's get into this. Okay. Mm. Oh, okay, so she... It's funny how a program designed to help organize your life. Is the reason why I can't be at the Labor Day party. Angry typing. But I'm glad we made the deadline. And I'm glad I can now spend two stress-free free weeks in good old Providence Oaks. Hello? There it is, Steve. Uh, hope I didn't wake you up. I just came home and was wondering if everything worked out all right. Hi, Steve. Yes, we made the deadline. Oh, that's awesome. Uh, I feel so bad you couldn't make it. Hope you guys had a nice Labor Day party. Oh, yes. I mean, the band was great and Mike fell in the pool. <laughs> oh, and then Roy got really sick. No, wait, Brian. And then he fell in the pool, too. And... No, Roy. Uh, wait. Wow. Ah, well, I'll tell you all about it at work tomorrow <laughs> morning. Well, <laughs> afternoon. I, I won't be there for two weeks, remember? Oh, wait, yeah. But, uh, but do you really have to? Mm, yeah. <laughs> two weeks is a lifetime. Yeah, Steve, I really have to. But I will continue testing for at it. Oh, okay, right. Awesome. Um, you know, I better get some sleep now. My plane leaves early in the morning. Okay, Meredith. Have a wonderful flight. I, I'll talk to you soon. Hmm. Add it. I wonder if that's what she was using, because honestly, that looked a little antiquated. Providence Oaks, Oregon. Thanks so much for picking me up, Mr. Coleman. Mr. Coleman? Please, just call me Frank. We're colleagues now, after all. Well, okay, Frank. Thanks so much for making time for me on Labor Day. No problem, Meredith. Postal workers always have each other's back. Your dad helped me dozens of times whenever I was in a bit of a pickle. I well, like hope I can bit. fill his shoes. He hardly ever missed a day. I'm sure you'll do great. You know what? While we're en route, why don't we deliver some mail in our beautiful little lake town? And show me the ropes? Sure. All right, then. Get ready to roll. Hmm. This lake, it's always more beautiful than I remember it. I don't think I'll ever get tired of driving around it. And there's our first stop. All right. Okay, sir, what's the plan? Not Delivering yet. mail is like a walk in the park with mailboxes. Take this bag, walk to the mailbox, and insert the mail. Okay, so exit mail truck. I'm so used to, like, getting into the game and start playing. I'm like, okay, let's go, let's go. 
Okay, so to walk around our normal WASD keys, walk to the mailbox, okay? Is there like a shift? No, nope. let's go faster. Okay, so deliver mail, E. So far so good, pretty easy. So to look around, do we use the middle or can we just use the mouse? Or can we use the middle button? Looks like we can. All right, so now what do we do? Walk back to the mail truck. All right. E to enter. Nothing too difficult. No, right? pretty easy. I think I should be able to face the challenge. Me too. <laughs> I bet. Didn't you go to MIT? Yeah. I left here from Massachusetts 22 years ago. Shouldn't you get a job in computers then? That's really booming right now. Well, actually, I'm... Uh... Hold that thought. We just arrived at our next address. It's a package this time. So you'll have to get it out of the back. Okay. So E to exit. And then we need to go to the back. Okay, go to the back. Open. Um, pick up. Walk to the front door of the house. What a lovely neighborhood. Really. The sensitivity is a little high. I don't know if that's something that I can adjust because I just like turn a little bit and it's camera moves quite fast. Okay, so do we need to ring the doorbell or just deliver the parcel? Oh, it does both. Oh, we nope. actually did. No answer. Okay. I'm calling it a day. I was going to say my, my mail carrier does not ring our doorbell. Packages get left. Walk, uh, walk back. Oh, to hold shift. So it is walk faster. I mean, it's not by much, really. Yeah, not, it's not a lot. Okay. So. You're getting the hang of it. So, where were we? Computers. Should I buy one? Uh, well, it depends on what you want to use it for. Bookkeeping. I always make a mess of my tax returns. Can't a computer do that for me? Yeah. Sure, there are programs for that. But you'll still have to put in some work yourself. I was afraid you were going to say that. I'll bug you about it another time. Our next address is right around the corner. Hmm. So it said the date was 1986, I think. <sighs> There's no place like home. Sure isn't. Can't wait to get home either. The Mets are playing the Giants. Oh, before I get out, what time do I start tomorrow? 7 a.m. sharp. Just check in at the post office. Okay. Okay, Frank. See you tomorrow. Adios. Ciao. Oh. Sweet. Is this my house? It's cute. Very nice. So she's only here for two weeks, and she'll be delivering the mail uh, while she's here. Not sure exactly why. So why is residence Monday afternoon? Hi, Meredith. I just wanted to let you know that Dad and I landed safely. <sighs> the Florida weather is all they said it would be. I'll call again soon. Oh, oh, one more thing. The freezer's stuffed with food and there's blueberry pie in the fridge. Bye. Nice. Meredith, it's Steve. I didn't get the chance to say it earlier, but thanks so much for being a trooper. I know you had other plans for Labor Day weekend, but nailing the deadline for Ad at 87 could very well be the most important milestone in our company's history. Enjoy your well-deserved time off. Don't get too used to it. Just kidding. Or am I? <laughs> uh, I'll talk to you later. Wow. Okay. Okay, so far, I'm not getting the same... I'm... Mm, no, it's not the same as... Good uh, morning, Meredith. Ready for your first day? Life is strange. Okay, good morning, Frank. Ready to rock. Yawns, I guess. Good morning. Okay, she would be chipper, I think. So, good morning, Frank. Ready to rock. All right, okay. Please. Good morning, Frank. Ready to rock. It's a great day to be on the road. I already filled up the mailbag in the truck, so you're good to go. Oh, I forgot to tell you. There's a map in the cabin, in case you get lost. Thanks, I'll probably need that. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, I'll probably need that. Bon voyage! Arrivederci. 
So I would think that you would need to take some kind of test to be sure to like deliver the mail, but this is a small town, so maybe not. But um, I used to work for the airlines. You had to like know city codes, airport codes, things like that. Um, I'm sure that you have to know like zip codes and things for, oh gosh, we got to drive. I've always wanted to drive a mail truck. Okay, so M to open my map. So basically, I'm going to be delivering the mail here. Ooh, remember Paperboy? That was the game back in the day. Loved, loved, loved Paperboy. Mini nights playing Paperboy. Okay, so I need to deliver letters and parcels to the list there. So I'm closest to here. Two oh seven. Okay. So two oh seven. Is this it here? Let's get out. Is this two oh seven? Yep. Oops. Left, Left the, pack the package in the truck. Yep. I wasn't thinking. I just was <laughs> gonna walk in the store like, hey. Okay. Up in the truck. So, oh, we have to make sure we get the right package. Nice. Okay. Wonder what would happen if we delivered the wrong package. We should try it. Not right now, though. That's lighter than I thought. Okay. Hello. Talk to General Store Clark. Can I help you? Yes. Hello. Here's today's mail. Mm, new in town. Your face looks familiar. Well, I grew up here and then left for college 22 years ago. <sighs> 22 years ago, back when they called me Nancy Sinatra instead of Nancy Reagan. So now you're back, mm. huh? I know what it's like. Uh, you do? You do? It's best not to feel bad about it. Only a few people ever really make it. Oh. I wonder if it's going to rain today. It's been raining a lot lately. Small talk. So, okay, she thinks that she's back in town for good. I see what she's saying. Oh, my gosh. Mr. X. <laughs> Mr. T. Cereal. <laughs> Pop song. Is that, what was that? Um, I forgot the name of that popcorn. Okay. Let's head back. Okay, let me get out before I get some kind of copyright. <laughs> um, okay, next stop is a letter. Should we stop or should we go? Is it? Okay, it's here. Wait a minute. I really like the graphics so far. I love the art style. But I wish she would walk a tad faster. Is this right? Deliver mail. I remember this is the old Sugarman place, but the envelope says McGill. Must have moved away. Well, it's been 22 years, so yeah, probably. Okay, so let's take the next stop that's around the corner. I'll admit this is kind of slow paced right now. Um, I'm used to games that have a little bit more action. Okay, this, this might have been... I should have probably went the opposite direction, but... Ooh, look at that. Look at that lake. East Lakeview Boulevard. Look at that. This is gorgeous. Ooh, can we go over here? Can I back up? Let me back up. I want to see. Oh. I just want to see if we can take the off road. So this is a deer crossing. This might not be a good idea. <laughs> might not be a good idea. It's a shortcut. It's a shortcut. See, look. Not so bad. Okay. I guess it was like a gravel road or something. It, the texture look, made it look like it was like still grass, but okay. So this is our next stop, this diner. 
Whoa, look at. Okay. Um. There's Stan's Diner. Wait, it's called Moe's Diner now? Like a glove. Okay. Do, can we jump? We cannot. We've got to take a long... Oh, gosh. Wait. Where's the Where's package? Where's the package? Oh, come on. <laughs> I should have parked close to the door. Seriously. Sorry, 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 sorry. At least she's nice about it. Uh, where's the package? Okay, so this is 500 Lake. So it's this package. Uh, pick up. I'll go this way this time. All right. I think this would be a great casual game to play. On Meredith your Wise? As I live and breathe. Come here, hon. Uh, now, let me look at you. My, oh my. A few lines here and there. And the occasional gray hair. But by gosh, it's you, all right? Uh, well, hello to you, Murray. Yeah, I mean, hi. Let's point all my flaws out. Like, hello. Well, hello to you too, Maureen. Oh, don't be like that now. It suits you. Age only makes a person more distinguished, is what I always say. To the mirror. Now come here. Tell me everything. Um. Yummy, yeah, she is on the clock. But, Maureen, I do have work to do. I know you're busy, huh? Little bird told me all about your temporary mail job already. Mm, small town. News goes around pretty quickly around here. Mm -hmm. So, coffee? Something stronger? I warn you, I will not take no for an answer. Um, coffee sounds good. Coffee sounds good. Thanks. Two coffee coming right up. And one piece of blueberry pie, if I remember correctly. You had one almost every afternoon after school at one point. Yikes. To law my business. Um, actually, I try to stay healthy these days. Yeah. Well, I mean, Mom put a blueberry pie in it, so let's just go for it. Oh, you know me too well, Maureen. Always have, always will. Ashley, one blueberry pie. <laughs> <laughs> and Ashley, uh, could you keep an eye on the bar for me for a bit? I'm going to take my break now. You're a real trooper. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Ashley? Oh, sweet Mary. What are you doing? Uh, is everything okay, hon? Yeah, no, Oh, Lord have mercy. Um, yeah, maybe you should check that out. M maybe you should check that out. Honestly, first the roof and now this? Ugh, that poor kid is like a disaster magnet. I'm sorry, Meredith. Looks like I've got my hands full for a bit. Next time, I want to hear everything, you hear? Uh, don't be a stranger now. Okay. So no coffee, no blueberry pie. That's fine. We got work to do. All right. So what was the reset? Okay. Can we redo that? Interesting. Okay. So next stop is this way. Wow. Um, so we go down this road. Here. Let me just check the map really quick. So it looks like we have a package this way. I guess we can swoop around. No, that's all. Okay, that's good. It's all one way. Yeah, I'm definitely going to recommend this as a casual game to chill after, you know, just a relaxed time so far. Um, because just driving around delivering mail, it takes a minute. Um, and this, this would be a, a cool little couch game, I think. So, okay. Keep straight. Keep straight. But I don't think this Actually was... Actually enjoying this. Really? I mean, I would, too. Look at that. Uh, straight. 
Look at that view. Oh my gosh, I could look at that all day. Yeah, this is definitely a chill couch game so far. I don't know what's going to happen. I mean, this oh, could... the mighty Ambrose River. Hmm. This could take a turn. Uh, you didn't stop. Rude. Okay, so... Stop here. <laughs> Look how I parked. Um... Is it the, no, wait, wait, wait. Oh, it's right here. Oh, I could have drove a little bit further. Let's do that. Let's do that. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Okay. Now let's get out. That's a little better with the parking. <laughs> Just like real life. And... Happen, and I think we have like five more stops. I feel like we do. Uh, okay, three, three more stops. I don't know why I said five. So once we're done delivering the packages, does that mean that we're done with the day? We'll find out, I guess. Oh, you know what? Whatever, we're getting out. <laughs> Oh, packages. Oh, they have a lot of cats. Lots of cats. Cat lady. This is... Oh, gosh. I don't know. Okay, let's close this. Because I have no idea what house this is. Um, will it tell me on the map here? Uh, 200 light. Okay. So somebody's getting a teddy bear. Cute. Well, hello there, big cuddly guy. Right? That is adorable. I love the little wrapping. Oh, there's four cats in the yard, y'all. Five cats. Oh, oh somebody's home. look, Genevieve. Six cats. A new mailman. Hello there. What's your name, then? Uh, hi, Miss Jenkins, right? I'm Meredith, Meredith White. We'll just, we won't correct her, okay? We know what she meant. Hi, Miss Jenkins, right? I'm Meredith. Meredith Weiss? Weiss, of course! You're Emily's girl, aren't you? Sure This am. is Meryl Weiss, Genevieve. She used to live in town years and years ago. Um... 22 years to be exact, but who's counting? 22 years to be exact, but who's counting? <laughs> Has it been that long? That's almost oh, two Genevieves ago. <laughs> Calm down, Genevieve. You're going to live forever. She isn't, but shh. <laughs> you do remember me, don't you? Um... The cat lady. Well, I guess I was right. How could I forget Miss Mildred Jenkins? How could I forget Miss Mildred Jenkins? And her cats, of course. Seems like they've multiplied. Yes, I do like cats. Is that such a crime? Oops. So what if I have slightly more of them than I used to? I like wasn't Genevieve trying to be offensive. Here, and Thomas and Oliver. Anyway, did you have a package for me then? Yes, ma'am. Here you go. Yes, ma'am. I think it's a toy bear. I mean, it's shaped like one and feels plushy. Someone must think you need another animal in your life. Hmm. Bit of a nosy posy, aren't you? I know Frank would never feel up the packages. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm sorry. I apologize. I didn't mean to pry, Miss Jenkins. Hmm. Well, it's probably another gift from my son. Still doing everything to get into my good graces, except actually drop by. Hmm. Yeah. Gotta run. Not gonna well, anyway, step into that. Gotta run. Run along, dear. Give Emily my best. Goodbye, Miss Jenkins. Genevieve. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't going to, uh... Oh, look... Look at the mailbox. 
Uh, I wasn't going to go any further with that conversation. She'd already got me for her feeling of the package, I guess. I don't know. Um, can I just... Oh. Well, hello. All right. So next two stops and we'll be done. In a few days, I won't even need that map. Right? Didn't we stop here earlier? Okay, so, or at least the day before. Oh, can we talk to this person? Wait, where's the package? Oh, I can't, like, walk around and talk? Okay. So, this is the last package. So, we're going to pick this up, and then we're going to... Who do we need to, to give this to? Do we need to give this to this person? Hi there. I've got some mail for this address. You're not Frank. Um, yeah. Luckily, I don't think a mustache would suit me. Haha, ha, real funny. But that doesn't explain why Frank gave you the keys for the goose. The goose? Yes, your white and wobbly van, duh. I'm Lori, I'm Providence Oaks mechanic. And I'm the one who keeps the goose running. Um, Thomas is my father? Well, Thomas is my father. Does that count? Thomas! Yes, that surely counts. My father has been teaching me since the day I was born. There is no one better in P.O. than me. And I have to get back to work now. But I suppose you may drive the goose. On one condition. If there's ever anything wrong with it, you bring it back to me, yes? All right, I promise. All right. All right, I promise. Good. Perfect. Uh, did Frank tell you about the radio? No. No. It currently only receives the local station. Plus, sometimes it cuts out altogether. If that happens, just give it a big old bang on the dashboard and that should fix it right up. I'm working on it, I promise. Okay, thanks. Okay, thanks, Lori. No problem, Miss W. Okay, I think we have one more stop to make. And so then we'll be done. Gonna head out. Let's see, it's down the road a ways, looks like. Can we take another shortcut? I'm I'm wondering if there's a lot of invisible walls, like if we can't really veer off um, the road, how, just how linear this game actually might be. Right now it feels quite linear. Let oh, this is... Think. Where was Bear Creek again? Oh, we're about to find out, looks like. Okay, wait. This way? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh, no, no, no. In real life, this would not be happening. I would not be going across this bridge. Absolutely not. Oh, right. Bear Creek, near the old lumber yard. Cute space, though. Oh, I like this. All right. Deliver the mail. Can we go in? There's a new face. Hi. A rare sight for a secluded lumberjack? <laughs> yeah. Last time I saw a human being was about six years ago. Wow. <laughs> I'm here to deliver mail, and I come in peace. I'm Meredith. Thank you. I'm Robert. I hope the peace will be everlasting. Let's see what's inside. Oh, what the... Mm, guess not. I'll leave you to it. Have a nice day. Uh, yeah, thanks, and sorry. It's not your fault. This is full of bull crap. Okay. Sure. Okay, let's go home. It looks like we can go home. I think. I don't know that. Or maybe we go back to the post office. Um, let's back it on up. Me. see how do we get okay back across this rickety bridge wait am I going the right way uh, let me look so this is okay yeah so is this where we go right here yeah so can I mark it on the note can't oh wait I can let's try placing a waypoint so X places a waypoint uh, oh, tab hides a delivery list. Gotcha. 
Okay. All right. Oh, there's an autopilot? Hold on. Oh, there's even a calendar. Okay. Um, so, autopilot. So, how do I do that? High delivery. Um, I thought I saw an autopilot. E. Oh, sweet. Look at that. Look, Ma, no hands. Very nice. And it drives faster. <laughs> That's great. Although I think I have a lot more fun driving myself. It's kind of nice for those of us who are GIMPS drivers. When it, Oh, I think I would have driven way better. But those of us who are GIMP drivers in games like these, autopilot. It's really cool. Okay, cool. Can I take it off? Nope. Oh, yeah. So F to stop autopilot. Very cool. Okay. I would like to do some exploring, but I don't know how much off course I can veer. But maybe I can try that on my own time. We're going to go ahead and pass this. <laughs> I want to know passing zone. <laughs> don't drive like that. Uh, looks like I'm coming up to my, yeah. This is a really cute town. I could live here, truly. It's gorgeous. Oh my goodness, okay. So that's the post office to my right. Right here? Yeah. Um, yep, that's it. Whoa! Like a glove. Perfect parking. Okay, so Tuesday evening, Weiss residence. So I can end my work day now. Hello? Hi, Meredith. It's Mom. How are you? How's the job? Um, I'm doing great. Hi, Mom. I'm doing great. It's so relaxing to be outside and drive around. Mm -hmm. uh, that's great to hear. Dad says it's strange not having to drive the truck anymore. I can imagine. <laughs> I can imagine that. How is Dad? Can he handle all this freedom? Ugh, don't get me started. He went on two fishing boat trips already. And then there's the late night poker with his new buddies. Oh, I'm almost out of coins. I'm calling from a bar and dad's ordering a margarita again. <laughs> Talk soon. Okay. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and end it here. Um, looks like we can stay home and watch TV, stay home and read a book. Kind of like that. Uh, so far, I'm liking the game. If for, you know, something that's a little more casual. Uh, not usually my my thing unless I'm like, relaxing on the couch or something but um yeah so far i like it i'm i'm interested in seeing how this is going to go for meredith uh why she's on her vacation delivering mail unless it sounds like she's like taking over for her dad for a while but yeah interesting so far i really like the graphics love the art style uh, the music's really relaxing. The driving's really easy. Controls are very easy. Um, I wish she walked a little bit faster, but I do enjoy the autopilot. Um, so, yeah. Hope you guys like this. Look into First look into Lake, and hopefully we'll get a chance to uh, revisit this soon. And until next time, I have been Pixelated Twix. Ciao.